Today's lesson is why are manhole covers round? Hi, everybody. I'm Roger. Hello, I'm Kiki. And the title of our article for today is a question: Why are manhole covers round? A manhole cover, okay? You see them every day if you live in a city. They're round and they're on the ground. And in some places, they have kind of interesting designs on them. I know that's popular in Japan to have all these different kinds of manhole covers with unique designs, and people actually take pictures of them and collect pictures of them. I've seen some pretty interesting manhole covers here in Taiwan as well. Well, here's a fun fact: if you go on Google Maps, you can actually download a list. Of all the beautifully designed manhole covers all over Taipei, and you can go on a search for them. Interesting. So that might、uh, give you something to do, and you can take a selfie lying on the ground next to that manhole cover. But a manhole, of course, is a hole in the ground where men can go down into the sewer. Or where the pipes are, or the wires, or whatever, and they can work on those things. And、uh, we're asking the question here: Why are they round? Yeah, why can't they be square or triangular or heart-shaped, for that matter?、Mm -hmm. Well, we're going to find out today because it has something to do with geometry. So let's find out by listening to part one. Why are manhole covers round? Manholes were invented when sewers first started being built underground to accommodate sewage system growth. They came into existence to enable maintenance workers and repair equipment to enter the tunnels. At the same time, manhole covers were made to prevent things from accidentally falling in. Why, though, are manhole covers always round? Everyone. 第一部分，我们来介绍动词 accommodate。它的意思是容纳、迎合，也可以是调整以适应的意思。例如 ，The farmer built an extra paddock to accommodate his herd of sheep。那位农场主人多建了一个围场来容纳他的绵羊群。又或者说 ，It took the panda several weeks to accommodate to his new home in the zoo。那只猫熊花了好几周才适应它在动物园里的新家。接着。看到副词 accidentally， 指的是意外的或是偶然的。例如 ，Elizabeth accidentally deleted her essay and had to start over. Elizabeth 不小心删除了她的论文，所以必须重新开始写。或者 ，My parents once accidentally locked me out of the house because they thought I was already inside. 我的爸妈有一次不小心把我锁在了屋外，因为他们以为我已经在屋里了。Okay, let's talk about the first part of our lesson for today. It begins by saying, "Manholes were invented when sewers first started being built underground to accommodate sewage system growth." Now, a sewer is a series of canals that carry wastewater to a place where it can be treated or gotten rid of. That's what a sewer is. And of course, you're going to have all sorts of nasty things in that water. You can have bodily waste and other. The things, and so people need to go down there and work in those areas, and that's what the sewer is. I guess sewers used to be above ground. If people went to the bathroom and flushed the toilet, the water would flow through canals or conduits that were ground level, and that, of course, would make things smell really bad. And eventually, sewers went underground. And of course, sewers accommodate sewage system growth. If you accommodate something, you kind of handle it. You do what you're supposed to do with that thing. Right. And when something accommodates something, it needs to fit the needs of something else. So as the cities start to grow, we need to build more buildings and skyscrapers. These sewers they can't be above ground anymore, so they need to accommodate the city's growth and the sewage system. The way It's growing, so they've gone underground. They came into existence to enable maintenance workers and repair equipment to enter the tunnels. So when something comes into existence, it is the reason why something needs to be invented or something is built because of something else. So in this case, it is 
sewers or these manholes. So why were manholes invented? Because they needed to allow maintenance workers and repair equipment to go in to the sewers to fix things or to maintain things. So coming into existence is when something is created to allow something else to happen. Right. So you've got that sewage system that's underground. That's where the sewer is, and you need to go down there to work on things from time to time. And you need to send people down there, and you need to send equipment down there. So you go through the manhole, and again they go into those tunnels and. Do what they're supposed to do. A maintenance worker is somebody who does maintenance, which is basically repairing something and keeping it. Operating properly, you want to perform good maintenance on your vehicle. For example, you need to check the oil and make sure the belts are okay and、uh, the spark plugs or whatever. So you need to keep checking that stuff to make sure it's operating properly. You need to perform good maintenance on your car, and I'm sure you know all about that, Kiki, because you're a race car driver and you need to perform maintenance on your car all the time, right? Right. And in this case, these sewers they need to be maintained. Other Wise, we might have sewage blocking certain parts of the pipes and sewers, so that will cause a lot of trouble. So that's why these maintenance workers they need to come down into the sewage system all the time to make sure everything is. Running smoothly or flowing smoothly. Okay, so at the same time, manhole covers were made to prevent things from accidentally falling in. So we know that these maintenance workers they need to have access to the sewers. So there were holes. There were these manholes. But if we don't cover them, people are just gonna fall in, or things will fall in accidentally. So when something happens accidentally, it is by accident. It is something that you didn't do on purpose. So if we left these holes uncovered, people might fall in. Things might fall in. So why though? Are manhole covers always round? It's a good question. Yes, we did pose the question earlier in the article in our title here. Yeah, why are they round? Yeah, why are they round? We're going to attempt to answer that question as our lesson continues. So let's get to it. Let's move on to part two, and we'll listen first. The first reason is a matter of safety. The geometric properties of shapes like squares, rectangles, and triangles mean that covers with those shapes could easily fall through manholes of corresponding shapes if they are tilted. In contrast, a circular manhole cover cannot fit through a circular opening even when tilted, thus preventing injury to anyone working below. Secondly, manhole covers are typically quite heavy; therefore, circular covers are easier to maneuver than those with other shapes. Because they can be rolled on their edges. Second part, we see tilt. This verb means to turn sideways or to turn sideways. For example, Kathy tilted her phone until the angle was just right for the photograph. Kathy tilted her phone until the angle was just right for the photograph. Kathy tilted her phone until the angle was just right for the photograph. Kathy tilted her phone until the angle was just right for the photograph. The teacher always has to remind the students that if they tilt their chairs back, they will fall over and hurt themselves. 老师总是要提醒学生，如果他们坐椅子时向后倾斜，就会跌倒并受伤。下一个是形容词 circular， 表示圆形的或是环状的。可以说 ，For this exercise, begin by swinging your arms forward in a circular motion. 这个运动一开始的动作是双臂向前画圆摆动。又或者说。There is a circular track around the building where people go jogging in the afternoon. 该大楼周围有一条环形跑道，人们下午时可以在那里慢跑。So let's find out why manhole covers are always round. The first reason is a matter of safety. So basically, because of safety, these manhole covers they need to be round. When something is a matter of, it means it is the 
reason for something to be the way it is or the answer to something. So in this case, a matter of safety, the reason is for safety. Okay. Another example to use a matter of would be today's parent teacher association meeting is on the matter of school security. Mm -hmm. Or I could say, for example, why should a man and a woman get paid for the same job? Well, it's a matter of equality. Everybody should、uh, get the same pay for doing the same job. And indeed, why we have manhole covers is a matter of safety. It's for safety. It's because of safety. The geometric properties of shapes like squares, rectangles, and triangles mean that covers with those shapes could easily fall through manholes. Of corresponding shapes, if they are tilted. So this is the first reason. It's because of safety. It's a matter of safety. We've got these geometric properties of shapes, like squares, rectangles, and triangles, and ovals, and things like that. If something's geometric, it has to do with geometry, and geometry, of course, has to do with basically shapes and lines and things like that. Maybe you've studied geometry before. In high school or in university, and these are geometric properties which have to do with shapes, like a square which is four-sided, a rectangle which has two straight sides and two longer sides, and then we've got triangles which have three lines, and we've got other shapes as well. Those have to do with geometry. Right, and because of these other shapes, it means that if These manhole covers were, let's say, in the shape of a square, rectangle, or a triangle. If they were tilted, then it's easy for these manhole covers to fall through. So they could easily fall through manholes of corresponding shapes if they are tilted. Okay, so when something is tilted. It is to move or cause something to move into a sloping position, so it's no longer flat. It is on its side. Okay, so for example, we see the Leaning Tower of Pisa. It is tilted. Okay, so that's what tilted means. And in this case, we talk about these geometric. Properties of shapes like squares, rectangles, and triangles, and if the covers were in these shapes, then they could fall through the manholes of corresponding shapes. So when we're talking about corresponding in this case, it's basically referring to the shapes that we mentioned above, which again is the square, rectangle, triangles. If they were in these shapes, these corresponding Shapes, then they will fall through the manholes if the holes on the ground were the same shapes as these covers. Right. So corresponding here just means the matching shapes. You've got the shape of the hole, and you've got the shape of the manhole cover, so they match up. And again, tilted, as you said, means kind of leaning. Like for example, maybe we've all seen puppies. They're oh so cute. And if you make kind of a strange sound, if you whistle at them, they will tilt their heads sometimes. Times because they're puzzled. Hey, what's that sound? It's kind of interesting. And little puppies will tilt their heads. And here, if you tilt these things in a manhole cover, and they're square or they're rectangular, they're going to fall right down on top of the worker down there and give him a concussion or something like that. And we don't want that to happen. Or maybe somebody might fall into the hole as well. And in contrast to this. At the opposite of this, a circular manhole cover cannot fit through a circular opening, even when tilted. Thus, or as a result, this prevents injury to anyone working below. So, in contrast, that just means when we're comparing two things in one way, it's this way. But in contrast, the opposite is. So, in contrast, if you have a circular manhole cover, in contrast to square ones or rectangular ones or triangular ones, the circular manhole cover will not fit through that circular opening, and therefore the manhole cover will not be able to fall through an opening. It's just where something is opening. I'm looking for an opening in the wall, so I can. And peek through and see what's happening on the other side. You're looking for an opening, or you might be looking for an opening at a company. I'd really like to work for your company, but they don't have any jobs available. I'm waiting for an opening or an opportunity. So we've been talking about these circle manholes, okay? And here we have this word circular, and basically the word circular is to. 
form a circle. And it is the way we describe something being round or circular. There are other words to describe other geometric shapes like rectangular to describe something that is in a rectangle shape or triangular, something that is triangle. Okay, so circular is basically to describe something that forms a circle. So let's continue with part two. Secondly, manhole covers are typically quite heavy. So they're very heavy. Therefore, circular covers are easier to maneuver than those with other shapes because they can be rolled on their edges. Okay, so mm. because these manhole covers, they're heavy when these maintenance workers, when they need to move them, it's heavy. They need an easier way to move them. So if it's circular, you can roll it on its side or on its edge. Whereas if it's a square or a triangle, obviously we can't roll it. So that's one of the reasons why manhole covers are circular. Okay, that comes to the end of part two. Let's listen to part three. Another advantage of a disc is that it's more likely to drop back into position if disturbed by a vehicle passing over it. Finally, there's also an economic benefit of using round covers. A circular cover requires less material than an equivalent sized square cover. So round covers are both cheaper to make and lighter to ship. So why are manhole covers round? It turns out there are lots of good reasons. The second economic. 指的是经济上的。我们可以说, the recent economic crisis has caused reduced employment and increased poverty rates. 最近的经济危机导致就业减少和贫穷率上升。也可以说, voters will want the new government to address their economic concerns. 选民会希望新政府解决他们的经济问题。再来看到equivalent,它是形容词,意思是相等的或是等值的。例如, in my opinion, this film has no equivalent. It's the best movie ever made. 依我看来,这部电影无可比拟,这是有史以来拍的最棒的一部片。或是, Emma's annual bonus is equivalent to two months' salary. Emma的年终奖金相当于两个月薪水。最后我们看到片语, turn out,指的是原来是点点点,或是结果发现点点点。举例来说, it turns out that James and Zoe have been dating for a while. 原来James和Zoe已经交往好一阵子了。再看一个例子, The small concert turned out well, with more people attending than expected. 这个小型音乐会结果表现不错, Okay, let's talk about part three now, and we're trying to answer the question, why are manhole covers circular, or why are they round? Well, another advantage of a disc is that it's more likely to drop back into position if disturbed by a vehicle passing over it. So that's another reason why manhole covers are circular, or they are disc-shaped. A disc here, of course, is a shape that is round and flat, like a record, a CD, a frisbee, those are all disc-shaped. So again, the manhole cover is disc-shaped, and the reason it is disc-shaped is that it will fall back into position if it's disturbed or moved by a heavy vehicle like a bus or a truck passing over it. Sometimes this does happen. You get a big bus going over a manhole cover and it kind of vibrates it and disturbs it and causes it to come out of the ground a little bit, but it will go back into position because it is round or it's more likely to drop back into position where it's supposed to be because it's round. Finally, there's also an economic benefit of using round covers. So by using round covers, it's not just because of its shape. It actually is more economic. What does that mean? Well, when something is economic, it means 
that it's related to money or finance. And in this case, it means that it uses fewer resources, or it might cost less to produce these round manhole covers. Could be. So that's one advantage. It has an economic benefit or economic benefit. You can pronounce it either way. A circular cover requires less material than an equivalent sized square cover. Or rectangular cover, for that matter. So round covers are both cheaper to make and lighter to ship. So we have equivalent. That just means the equal of something else. So roughly the same, the matching manhole cover that is in a different shape or has a different characteristic. Right. So round covers are both cheaper to make and lighter to ship. So this is the economic benefit of using round covers. So why? Why are manhole covers round? It turns out there are lots of good reasons, which we learned in today's article. So when something turns out to be something, that is the result of something, or that is the reason why. There are so many good reasons of something. Okay, so in this case, it turns out so the end result being that there are a lot of good reasons that manhole covers are round. All right, that takes us to the end of today's article. Let's listen to Henny. Hello, students. Hello, everyone. I'm Hanny. We're going to practice the five questions in the article. Let's look at the five questions in the article. The first question says, "They cover the tunnel to enable maintenance workers and repair equipment to enter the tunnels." The meaning is that they cover the tunnel to enable maintenance workers and repair equipment to enter the tunnels. The second question says, "They cover the tunnel to enable maintenance workers and repair equipment to enter the tunnels." The third question says, "They cover the tunnel to enable maintenance workers and repair equipment to enter the tunnels." The fourth question says, "They cover the tunnel to enable maintenance workers and repair equipment to enter the tunnels." The fifth question says, "They cover the tunnel to enable maintenance workers." Is 开始存在或是成型。C went into effect. 表示生效，开始实施。D fell into place， 表示变得有条不紊，按部就班的进行，变得明朗清楚了起来。好，那么课文前一句有提到说，人孔是在下水道最初开始在地下建造以容纳污水系统的扩张时发明的。然后空格后面又提到，点点点是为了让修缮工人和维修设备得以进入地道。那从语义上来看，它应该就是要说明这个人孔存在的目的，人孔。会出现的原因，最适合答案就是 B came into existence。好，那么第二题是 The first reason is 空格 safety。题目意思是第一个原因是安全空格。那这题考我们语义，来看选项 A a cause for 是表达是什么的理由原因 ，B a turning point in 是表达什么什么的转捩点，那么 C the key to 就是表达什么的关键。D a matter of 表达是什么的问题，取决于什么的问题。那么课文前一句有丢一个问题，就是说为何人孔盖总是圆形的呢？那语义上来看，最适合答案会是 D a matter of， 去表达说第一个原因啊就是安全问题。那其他三个选项语义都不符合。第三题，我们看到 the geometric properties of shapes like squares, rectangles, and triangles mean that covers with those shapes could easily fall through manholes of conga shapes if they are tilted. 题目意思是正方形、长方形和三角形等形状的几何特性，意味着如果倾斜，这些形状的人孔盖可能很容易从空格形状的人孔中掉落。这题考我们智慧，来看选项 A。Corresponding 是指相应的、相似的。B parallel 表示平行的、并列的或是同时发生的。C irregular 它表示不规则的、不规律的，或者是行为是不合常规的。D oval 它表示椭圆形的。那从语义上来看，它应该是要表达倾斜时，正方形、长方形和三角形等形状的人孔盖可能会很容易从这个相对应的形状的人孔中掉落。那最适合的答案就是 A。Corresponding. 好，那么第四题他写到，空格逗号 ，a circular manhole cover cannot fit through a circular opening even when tilted. 题目意思是，空格逗号，即使倾斜时，圆形的人孔盖也无法通过圆形的开口。那这题是考我们副词片语。我们来看选项 A. In addition 表示此外。
；B in contrast 表示相反的、相比之下 ；C at most 表示最多、至多 ；D to some extent 表示在某种程度上。那空格前面提到说，正方形、长方形和三角形的人孔盖容易掉进相对应形状的人孔中，而空格后面则说明圆形的人孔盖就算倾斜时也不会掉进圆形的开口中。因此，空格里面应该要填入能够强调前后差异的转折。词，所以最适合答案会是 B。In contrast， 再看到第五题，他说 ，Another advantage of a disc is that it's more likely to drop back into position if 空格 by a vehicle passing over it。题目意思是圆形盖的另一个好处是，如果被一辆行经它的车辆空格。它比较有可能掉回原本的位置。好，那么四个选项分别是 A disturbing, B it disturbs, C disturbed, D has disturbed。那这题是考我们分词，考我们对句子结构的了解。这个句子空格前方是 if， 那么后面是介系词片语 by a vehicle passing over it。那由于缺少了主词，我们可以推断空格里面是要填入分词，也就是啊，它是省略了主词之后，把动词改为分词的形式。那从句意来判断 ，disturb 这边应该是用被动语态，也就是说，它会由 if it is disturbed by 什么什么，然后简化成 if disturbed。by 什么什么，所以这个空格要填入过去分词 disturbed 才适合，所以答案选 C disturbed。好，那么以上今天讲解，我们来回顾今天单词吧。Accommodate. I reorganized the closet to accommodate the new shelves. Maintenance. Regular maintenance of your car will help prevent the need for costly repairs. Accidentally. Christine accidentally spilled coffee on her blouse while rushing to catch the bus. Circular. The garden features a circular path that leads visitors through its various sections. Economic. Atlanta's economic growth has been aided by the city's growing film industry. Equivalent. In comparing the two computers, Arthur found that they had roughly equivalent features. Well, everyone, today's article has come to an end, and I sure hope you enjoy reading along with us. I am Kiki. I am Roger. See, See you, you next time. time.